Hello everyone, thank you for joining us of Noonday Prayer today at the deepening. I'm Kolade and I will start the prayers in about a few minutes now. We'll be using the Hot of Service for Noonday on page 103 of the Book of Common Prayer. If you prefer to use the online version, there's a link to that in the comments. Um, I give you some time to open uh, together Bible and Book of Common Prayer and we'll start the service. Thank you again for joining us. Let us pray. O oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hallelujah. We now read the Psalms. We read Psalm Psalm 46 and Psalm 121. Psalm 46 is on page 649 of the Book of Common Prayer. God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. Therefore, we will not fear, though the heart be moved, and though the mountains be toppled into the depths of the sea. Though its waters rage and foam, and though the mountains tremble at its tumult, the Lord of hosts is with us, the God of Jacob is our refuge. There is a river whose stream shall make glad the city of God, the holy habitation of the Most High. God is in the midst of her, she shall not be overthrown. God shall help her at the break of day. The nations make much ado, and the kingdoms are shaking. God has spoken, and the heart shall melt away. The Lord of hosts is with us, the God of Jacob. Our strong God. Come now and look upon the works of the Lord, what awesome things he has done on earth. It is he who makes wars to cease in all the world, he breaks the bow and shatters the spear, and burns the shields with fire. Be still then and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations, I will be exalted in the heart. The Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our strong God. Psalm 121. I lift up my eyes to the hills, from where is my help to come? My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. He will not let your foot be moved, and he who watches over you will not fall asleep. Behold, he who keeps watch over Israel shall neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord himself watches over you. The Lord is your shade at your right hand. So that the sun shall not strike you by day, nor the moon by night. The Lord shall preserve you from all evil. It is he who shall keep you safe. The Lord shall watch over your going out and your coming in from this time forth forevermore. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We we'll now read this, this, the portion of the scriptures. Romans 5, verse 5. The love of God has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit that has been given to us. Thanks be to God. Lord have mercy, Christ have mercy, Lord have mercy. The Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, 
and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer, and let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, send your Holy Spirit into our hearts to direct and rule us according to your will. To comfort us in all our afflictions, to defend us from all error, and to lead us into all truth. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Now we'll be praying for individual requests. If you have requests you'd like us to pray about, please kindly put them in the comments. We will pray about them. And if we cannot go through everything right now, we will assure you that people will collect them and we'll pray about them during the week. As we continue prayer, let's pray for the prayer for those who influence public opinion on page 827 of the Book of Common Prayer. <laughs> Almighty God, you proclaim your truth in every age by many voices. Direct in our time we pray, those who speak where many listen and write what many read, that they may do their part in making the heart of this people wise, its mind sound, and its will righteous, to the honor of Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. There is no prayer request in the comments yet, so we'll just conclude the prayer now. Our Heavenly Father, we give you thanks for your goodness and your mercies and your loving kindness towards all your people. We thank you for answered prayers in this time of prayer. We give you praise. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Thank you again for joining us for prayer and enjoy the rest of the weekend. <laughs>